Hi everyone, in this tutorial, we're gonna add a WhatsApp share button to our product page in our Shopify 2.0 team. So this is what we're adding here. It's gonna look like this. And when the user or the customer choose a variant sample C a medium, and when they click the button, it should route them to this WhatsApp API. And you open the WhatsApp, and the user have a choice to who they want to share this to. So um, for me, I'm just going to share it to myself and then click this one. And this would have the uh, variant on what they choose and it will create a URL. Click send. When somebody click on this one, it should direct them to the right variant. But my store is not online right now, so you will not be able to see it. Anyway, it's easy to add with no apps or library, just a few codes. So to start, we have to go to our Shopify store. So in our Shopify store, we're going to go to online store and make sure you go click teams. And for me, I'm not going to edit the live team, but we're going to edit this new since 2.0 team. Um, we're going to click actions and then edit code. And from here, we're just going to expand our page by clicking this icon. And we're going to go to our section folder and we're going to look for main dash product liquid. Open that and we're going to control F to find uh, when buy buttons. So what we're going to do here is we're going to insert the code that we have. Let's go to our website and we're going to grab this code right here and go back to our code editor again and then paste this code right here. So let's just highlight this and then press shift tab to reformat it. And we're almost done. We're just going to add something to our schema. Just fix this one a little bit. And we're going to go down to our schema. Actually, we're going to find the buy uh, buttons again in the schema. We're going to insert the code here. So we're going to go to our website again and then grab this code right here. And then we're going to insert it before the buy buttons and let's fix it a little bit. Okay. And that's it. You have an option to change the labels. Uh, right click the customize team, open a new tab. When we go to our product page, you should be able to see the buy buttons. So let's add a block and I called it WhatsApp button. And we're going to be able to reposition it and you can change the level to whatever you want. So let's just say, uh, what's, uh, uh, share button and then click save. So it should work when you click on this one and that's it guys. It's a simple code, no sweat at all. I will be posting more videos. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.